Yo, what's up, my lovely Pokey Pickers? It's your boy, Welsh Pokey Picker. And today, Gilvac's having their first indoor car boot sale. So, I thought, let's have a look and see what bargains we can find. Oh yeah. So that's all the... How much are the marble figures? Is that skin? The big one, two pounds. Two pounds each, right. Morning. Morning. So it's one of these squish marbles. This is one of the desert box. I don't know where you can find these boxes. That is Rufus Avian. Yeah. Yeah. Four pound. Comes with a controller. Ah. Oh, I don't know these before. Incredible Hulk ones. How much are the Hulk um, fists? Oh, a pound? Yeah, I love them. I'll get this for three pounds. This is cool. Oh, that's cool. It's three pounds. Pick that up. Look at this guy, they're just. Games. Hey, what's up, guys? It is uh, Tuesday, and I've come to the local church community shop. Just thought because there wasn't that much in the boot sale, so I thought let's have a have a sneaky look and see what we can find. Nineteen ninety nine trade master. as well guys just to show you <laughs> look at this it's like a knockoff Pikachu but also in here I've also found these are the plushes I found the dog from uh, this the kid the snowman and the dog it was up there so I'm guessing that's a pair of like a six pound. that's creepy that is I don't know what it is so that's 50 one two pound 250, 3, 5, 50. Yeah, that's fine. Not a bad start, guys. £5.50 for all of that. Bargain. Can't go wrong for that. And someone's a big cat collector, guys. Let's go. Have seen that before? That's quite cool. Come and look at the cats, guys. And then did this one. It's called Nine Lives. I don't know if that's the actual price on it. Two pound. Oh, that's good. That's quite cool. Nice little collectors. And, uh, is, that, is that two pound, Frank? Or... Uh, yeah. Yeah, two pound. I'll pick that up. Right, guys, we're now back in the Pokey Cave, and here's a closer look of what I picked up. Now, <laughs> when I uh, first went into it uh, in the community shop, they were literally closing in, like, I would say, 10 15 minutes so i saw a couple of these in a box like especially jack and i just got my bag out and just started filling it up but yeah uh five five pound fifty no actually the toys were five pound fifty and that was two pound so that's seven pound fifty grand total but some amazing pickups 
we got uh, Boo, I think it is Boo, yeah, Boo, the the dog from uh, the snowman, the Jack skeleton I absolutely love, Jelly Cat, I know, whoops, Jack's decided to fall, Jelly Cat, because I know Ian does well on them, I have to check on what they're going for, then I got uh, this Paul Smith perfumes, and then I got this creepy thing. Let me show you what it does. Now I just researched this stuff. It's called a Wooloof Mummy or something like that. So it just makes it. It did make mm, it. Mommy, mommy. Oh my. I don't know how you trigger this thing. Mm. But it has got the little little one as well. So I'm going to have to have a look at that one. So yeah. I know they're going for between 15 and 20 pounds, so let's see what we can manage to get for the Poke Fun. As well, I picked up a couple of games from work, it's only six pounds, but they're going to go into the trade pile. Yeah, we had like a big bundle of games come in and uh, they wanted me to sort through them, so I only picked the ones I wanted for trading and I still pull out loads of really decent games. So they go into the trade pile. Also, well, guys. We got a few eBay sales. So let me show you what sold. We got two eBay sales from yesterday, guys, and they're big ones as well. First one is the Pokemon Heart Gold for the DS. That sold very quick as soon as I put this it up. That went for fifty-five pound plus the postage. And the Tornado My Little Pony from the eighties. That went for eighty pound free postage. So. £120 and selling our pence will probably be on the screen anyway but wow really nice and I pretty much covered the cost of the recent pickups I had the Cubone and the ETB so that's my money back so I can crack that bad boy open well I've just opened the Crown Zenith ETB box look at Lucario V-Star absolutely beautiful card and I'm probably have to send that off to Ace Graydon with uh, Ian again and we got another two more eBay sales. So let me show you. Ah. So yeah, Trifu Tom had sold for five pound plus postage, and the Lego lady, whatever, she has gone for six pound plus postage. So this is the grand total, and that will go into the Poke Fund. Happy days. Well, look at that. Same day after buying all the stuff for there, and I was a bit of a mess. The Hulk gloves have sold for £12 plus postage, so that has covered the cost of today's pickups. Nice. And here we are guys, we got Ruby and Sapphire. Finally going to add them to the collection. So they can go off the slot them right there for the minute. And get that facing that way. Go and try and sort that out. Still need to get a few more games, but yeah, the retro corner is looking a bit better. So yeah. So yeah guys, if you enjoyed this video with uh, me going to the, the first Gilbach car boot sale, it wasn't too bad, it was very small, hence that's why I called to the local community shop to see if I can fish up some more, just to make some more content. But yeah, some decent pickups and some cracking eBay sales as well for the Poke Fund. Um, so yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, like always, leave a comment down below what you thought about the pickups and the sales. Drop a, a like, and like always, make sure to Thunder Punch, Bubble Beam, Rock Smash, Earthquake, that subscribe button down below. I've been the boy, World Poker Picker. Keep on picking. Peace.